Hello, my name is Shannon Johnstone. I'm a photographer, a photography professor, and a writer on this course. And I'm here in the museum park today to talk to you a little bit about the differences between your point and shoot camera and your SLR camera. I have here a little point and shoot camera. And you can see here that when we turn it on, the lens pops out. You can see it's a fixed lens, which means that I can't take the lens off, it's attached. Um, if you see on the back here, you have an LCD screen that shows you what you're taking a picture of. And you can see here that there's not that many controls. It makes it very easy for you to take pictures. And that's where we get the name point and shoot from. It means that you can actually literally just point and shoot and take a picture. Now this is as opposed to the SLR camera, which you can see right here. This is a much bigger camera. It's much weightier, it's much heavier. It has a lot more controls, a lot more things you can set and a lot more features to it. Um, but in order to explain the differences behind what makes these two cameras different, I'm gonna use an old film-based camera. That's an SLR camera. This here is a film-based camera. It's not the same thing as a digital camera. You can see here on the digital camera, there's a screen that you can see on the back. That's not the case here with the film camera. But that word SLR, what that means is single lens reflex. And that word comes from the fact that what we see through the viewfinder here is the exact same thing as what we see through the lens here. And the reason for that is if we take the lens off, you can see inside the camera is actually a mirror. That allows you to see that. It's reflecting the light back up. Single lens, one lens, reflex means the light's reflecting back up through the camera. Now there's three things that make this camera different from this little point and shoot camera. One of them is this mirror, this inside here. The other one is the fact that I can actually take the lens off the camera. And the third thing is all the features on this camera, all the things I can set. That makes this very different from this point and shoot camera. And that's it.